Okay, just a very quick video. Um, I've been having problems with uh, my NVIDIA just in the fact that I want to go from a normal Windows mode, windowed mode, to surround mode for uh, iRacing because that's just the way I was showed how, shown how to do it. And uh, the problem is when I want to multitask and I want to do things on my desktop, it gets to be a real hassle uh, because when I want to look at a YouTube video and I want to look at full screen, it spans all three screens, all triple screens. And then I basically don't have triple screens anymore, so I can't have a video playing on one screen. Let's say YouTube is teaching me how to set up voice attack, and then I want to set up voice attack. Well, I have to keep pausing the video and going back and forth. So this is just to show you that uh, when you go into here and you go into options, graphics, you don't have to change any of this stuff when you go from windowed mode to um, surround mode back and forth. In fact it's best if you just leave everything the way it is. At least that's how it worked for me. Um, and then you'll find that your screen is in the middle and everything's really messed up. And then all you do is you, when you're in windowed mode, you can do this. So what you have to do is take your screen uh, and stretch it to the sides just like you would any normal browser window and I suppose there is a small possibility you could grab this and move it around accidentally during a race well not in a race but while you're in the pits or something but it's easy to set it back so I just wanted to show that also I turned off this jobby dynamic dynamic OBJS and picked up 10 frames per second so I'm glad I heard that I read that tip today too so anyways anyways if anyone wants to see what my setup is with an i5 7600 16 gigabyte DDR4 RAM and a GTX 970 this is what I set up and a lot of tracks I get between 70 and sometimes some tracks for some reason I'm over 100 but uh, for, at least for mid-Ohio I get uh, after I turned off dynamic OBJS um, I'm getting uh, 80, 75 to 82 frames per second as opposed to 69 to 72 when this was on. Uh, that's it. Hope that helps.